I, I don't know which way this is going to go. But up next, we're going to see two men that absolutely hate each other. The Genesis, the pinnacle of this feud. It comes to a head here tonight in Columbus. First Blood, Matt Taven, Cody. We will settle the score here tonight at Masters of the Craft. The ominous sounds, the tick-tock of the clock can only mean one thing. A man that's held three out of the four championships here in Ring of Honor. He's the historic middleweight champion in CMLL. And we'll take it to Nick Lendl for his official introduction. The following contest is a first blood match. Introducing first, being accompanied to the ring by TK Orion and Vinny Marsalia from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 227 pounds, he is representing the Kingdom, Matt Taven. You see the Ring of Honor World Six-Man Tag Team Championship on the shoulder of Matt Taven. The historic middleweight championship he defeated Volador Jr. for at CMLL around his waist. Melvin Bliss. Six-Man Tag is stolen, man. That's stolen. You can't even say anything about that. Yeah, Old that's property. stolen property. He's out there right now with TK Orion. It's going to be interesting to see if Cody comes with any reinforcements, TK. Yeah, I'm anxious to see if he comes out with any reinforcements. Willie, who knows? We're getting ready to find out, though. And by the way, but isn't possession nine tenths of the law? Yeah, but that checks that come with those titles, and he's not getting it, so I disagree. Well, so he's still nine tenths of the law. Right? Well, he's getting the checks from the historic middleweight championship. This match is not a number one contenders match. This. This does feature two of the top contenders, though. And I got to think, this might not only settle the feud, but we might establish a number one contender as well. I agree. And his opponent is representing Bullet Club. Being accompanied to the ring by Brandy Rhodes from Marietta, Georgia. Weighing in at 223 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody! Will you stop clapping, me? Hey, I can do what I want to do over here. Well, That's Arthur Cody now. down there. That's my buddy. You know, interesting to note, Taven with TK Orion, Cody with Brandy. You know, we don't see the Young Bucks, we don't see Patriot, we don't see Flip Gordon. Yeah, they're about himself. Yeah. Yeah. In interesting to know, no Benny Marcellia. So, Cody coming down with the one person we know he can trust, Brandy. Taven choosing to be accompanied by TK Orion. Well, here's my thing. Sometimes you don't have to have your friends with you, but when you know your opponent is bringing friends, you bring the boys along. That's a fair point, Caprice. To see the former Ring of Honor World Champion, Cody. This feud started back in December when we were in Philadelphia. We saw it unfold on Ring of Honor television in January. The bad blood between these two started when Cody addressed the crowd for the first time after losing the Ring of Honor World Championship. Matt Taven interrupted him, connected. He belvedered him. He low blowed him. And from there, it's been. They kicked him in the ding ding. Oh, it's been back and forth with that in singles and tag team action. Well, Taven believes that Cody's where he is because of his dad. Taven believes he's where he is because of hard work. There's a piece of that. There's also the piece of the conspiracy, where the money goes. Ring of Honor, you know, Bullet Club's heavily wait featured. A second, wait a second, what's he saying? I want to see her make you bleed. Yes, yes, I'm going to make you bleed right in front of her. Let Come her on. stay. He, he's saying he wants Brandy to watch Cody bleed. I thought she said something else. Oh, that's a piece of garbage right there, is Taven. Why would, why would you say something like that? You know, the object of to the match. To get in someone's head. Yeah, uh, well, to throw them off their game, that's exactly why you say something like that. I mean, both men know the rules. The winner of this match will be, and look, look at this now. The, the winner of the match will be the man who makes their opponent oh, bleed wait first. Wait a second, wait a second. Is he doing the boxing trick here? Oh, he, it looks like he's got Vaseline. He's, he's putting Vaseline he's put on. Vaseline. I think over his a, eyebrows, so make sure his eyebrows don't get cut. That way, any punch, any strike that slides. might hit the brow yeah. is going to slide off, and it's not going to make impact, and it's not going to split the skin. This is ridiculous. But I think it's a smart move getting Brandy out of there. It, it, it might be. It could be. Oh, I mean, oh, yeah. yeah, there we yeah, go. Make sure you wipe that off. 
wipe that off. You know, as much as you're in the in the bag for Cody, I agree. I want to see, you know, if they're going to settle this, if this is going to be the match that settles things for these two. Let's be honest, man. You got the Canem in the Bullet Club. This is going to be shenanigan city. He might be right. Here we go. The bell rings. It has been the case, but I'm hoping that we just see one on one action here. You'll see it. I hope they let Cody keep that ring on so he can just punch Taven right in the nose and we get first That'd blood. That'd be we first blood. That's a weapon, though. He needs to be taking it away. Well, that's, uh, that's up to Paul Turner there. Just like all these bets and oh. axes these jab turkeys we bring into the ring. Yeah, sense. what's that all about? Look at it. Trying to make him kiss the ring. Yeah, kiss the ring. If you got any sense, you'll kiss the ring. What's he talking about, his prop? What in the world? Oh, look at TK Ryan back in the ring. Oh! oh he oh. hit him with the ring! He I just hit it right on him. TK right Ooh. in the face. And he got Taven. No, he hit TK in the head with the ring. He got both of them. He dropped that, took that Taven too. Wait a minute, no. disaster. Oh. It was a palm thrust on Taven. That was a punch to the face on he TK. He punched TK right in the face. Cody on a roll now. Oh my God. I promise you, I'm not kidding. He punched him. I, I know, head. I saw it. Closed fist with the ring, punched TK right in the face. Cody stalking Taven around the ring. Taven believes there's a kingdom conspiracy that's holding him back from world championship opportunities. He wants to become a Grand Slam champion. He wants to win the, the only championship he's ever held. He said Cody was, was ducking him and, and got to where he was because of his family name while Cody was champion. And, and right now, yeah. that's what's been driving Taven. The, I, oh, TK. TK, look at oh, oh, man. The ring split TK open. Look at this. Oh, look at you. that. Right across I the forehead. You. I told you he hit that double spread. Hey, you know, Paul Turner, you might want to get the ring off, off of Cody here. I, yeah, that'll split your ring right open. Oh, uh -oh. wait a minute. Uh oh. Taven grabbing TK around the waist. I know what I saw. Good gracious. He had no business being in there, though. I mean, come on, man. You, I might have done the same thing. My match is against Taven, not Taven and his friends. But he needs to take that ring off. I mean, it's a weapon. Yeah, you can't beat that one. Sending Orion back. And here we go. We're going to see one-on-one. -on -one. Dang. It's going to be Taven and Cody. These two men absolutely hate each other. Get the ring, ducks the clothesline. Ooh! Gets a disaster of his own. There you go. Uh, oh. don't, Paul, oh. don't let him take the ring. Yeah, he's got the ring. He shouldn't have it. Uh-oh. I agree. Taven, he's looking to end this real quick. Swing and a miss. Kick to the midsection. Going for the wrist lock. Cody. Oh, wow. just releasing him. <laughs> Threw him through the wow. air. Release suplex. Driving Taven over the ropes. Cody trying to get the fans behind him here in Columbus. So much to unpack here with Cody. So yeah. may, maybe I'm the turkey with the first blood match. This stuff uh -oh. is legal. Yeah, I, I mean, it seems like anything goes here in this first blood match. Turner. Yeah, Turner's letting it go. Absolutely. You know, it, it's so weird for me to hear fans cheer Cody because just last week against Kenny Omega, it, it seems like the fans were behind Omega. Yeah. But here in Columbus, oh, he's going right oh. for it. Look at that, oh, look at that exposed yeah. piece of the railing. Oh. You know, this brings me back in a day like 86, the first blood match was like Tully Blanchard, Dusty Rhodes, Arn Anderson, Magnum T.A., Nikita Koloff. This is what this puts me in the mind of. I love watching wrestling, man. And this brings me like a time war. Ooh! Oh. Driving Taven through the guardrail. And Cody's a little surprised there was no blood on that one. You hear him? He said, are you kidding me? Where's the wow. ring at? Where is the ring? I think Taven has the ring, right? Did you put it in your pocket, no, BJ? Taven has to take the ring home? on his right hand. Taven has the ring on his right hand. I don't have the ring in my pocket. Springboard, looking for it. Oh! Oh! No! Ooh! He connected! Oh. That was a closed fist with the with ring. With the ring, yeah. Ooh! Took he it right took, to the... He took it off. Got him in the eye, and that eye was busted open just a few weeks ago. Driving that ring into the head. This might be a short one. 
Looking to operate on that scar tissue. Oh, he's stomping right on his face. And then I gotta ask you too, is it first blood like a little trickle or does somebody has to be like busted open? Like what, what kind of blood do we need it's to Definitely see? after the termination and the discretion of referee Paul okay. Turner for I mean, the I'm rules not, of this match, but. I'm not trying to be busy here, I just wanna know what it's. <laughs> oh yeah, I wouldn't go out there trying to get a paper cut on anybody. Follows him in, big forearm connects. Turned him inside out. On Taven. Cody lets Taven get back up to his feet. And now Taven. Oh! Uh, you know, I got to give Taven a lot of credit, even, even though they talk about a conspiracy and all this stuff. But he's been ma winning matches everywhere. Oh, and that's just the tip of the knee. Wow. And getting title shots in other countries, but not here at Ring of Honor. So and I if that of... knee hit him on that previously split open brow, that could end this match right now. Protecting the head just in case. Oh, he just removed the protecting pad from the turnbuckle. Oh, no. Taking off the top turnbuckle pad here in Columbus. What a win this would be for Taven. Oh, Irish whip reversed. What a win it would be for Cody. Either men would have a substantial claim for that Ring of Honor World Championship. Oh, oh. float over power slam. Beautiful rotation on the power slam. Seamless snap. Now, Cody in control. But if I was him, BJ, I'd get on top of him. I'd start punching. Right. I, I try and bust that eyelid open. I, I try. Split him open. These That's are what strategic do. wrestlers. Ian, when the last time you've been in the first blood match, Jive Turkey. Yeah, that was Jive me. Turkey. If that was me, I would. If that was me, I would. She's sitting at commentary. You, you both have a point. <laughs> and now Cody going for the chair. Oh, was that a roll of quarters? They went everywhere. What? Man. Ian, Ian, set down. Don't go try to go get those quarters. Look at that. Delivers a shot. Wow. Cody. Yeah, well, well BJ, I, I've never been on the end of that, but you have a Carino. Oh! He threw the chair in his face. And you took one of those from Carino, too, didn't you? What? I don't remember what you're talking about. Because he hit you too hard. You know, there's a chair shot that you get with somebody holding a chair, but when they build a chair at you, any part of that chair can hit you. Oh, absolutely. Cody now. Momentum has changed. Climbing springboard. Oh! oh my God! He threw the chair oh. in his face. No blood! I don't, Turner's saying no blood. Wow. Look at the disappointment on Taven's face. Like, please check again. He hit him flush with the chair. Oh! And here's what he's got to do. Oh! He tore that right off. Now, these. Oh, watch out, fans. These things are sharp and hard. Yes, they oh. are. I've cut myself on these daggone rings. I don't even know why they're out here, except for the fans to beat on them, but they have very jagged edges, and they're very sharp. They're like freaking aluminum out there for nothing. Oh, they're like razor blades yeah, on the edge. Yeah, I've cut my hand on them, my elbow. Open. Like, these things are really sharp. Uh-oh. Taven going under the ring. Oh, he's got a table. That right out here by us. Look at that. Oh, man. Taven's got the table. I like it when I see the table with two beams on the side of it. <laughs> Bringing it into the <laughs> ring. Yeah, nice sturdy table. Yes, sir. Uh, you going through that one, buddy. <laughs> Time to get up. Get up. I think somebody just got fined $100. I think so. Taven ah. going right oh, for it again. My God. Oh my God. Just hit me with the table, man. Don't, don't throw it at me. Nice. And he's getting in, he's getting in great shots right now. And if he can if he can knock Cody out, I'm sure he can cut him open. Taven's got the legs of the tables locked in. Table now in the center of the ring. There he is. There he is. So many other things can happen when you build a chair at somebody. I mean, a chair can catch your ear. It can hit you in the eye. You catch your ear and tear it right off, man. I've seen that happen. Well, we're going to find out what's going to happen here. Taven perches Cody, second rope on the inside. Sending the legs out. Ooh. Great assisted in Seguri there. Taven. straight and setting in. Uh -oh. Absolutely. The table's out there Oh, sure is. Too. Great shot from our camera crew here, Ring of Honor. Man. Looking for the superplex. Cody latching the legs oh, around the, the top turnbuckle. Yeah, he don't want to go through that table. He's going to catch splinters and all kind of stuff going through that one. Next with a straight right sends Taven back down. Uh oh. Oh, he's got his attention diverted. Cody. Oh! 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 
Ooh. That's Flinna City right there. I told you when he pulled it in the ring. Yes, sir. Yep, he gonna feel that the rest of the match. He's picking him out like the cactus. The <laughs> rest of the night. <laughs> Look at this, Taven still has a vertical base. Cody grabbing the knee now for the first time. Yeah. Taven feeling more that. confident. You oh, can see it in his face. Now he's got a weapon. Oh, he's jagged at pieces of wood. Oh, he's jagging in his head. I met Taven Cody, and you're going to remember that for the rest of your I was going to try and stab him in the face. That that's what I'm saying. Oh, oh. oh, this is too dangerous. This that's is dangerous. Easy, that's an easy cut. Whoa! Oh. Great jawbreaker. Prevents that from happening. Now, with first blood count, blood out of the mouth, too. Have to imagine, Caprice. Oh. Oh. Both men are down. Shoulder to shoulder, the head snapping together. Yeah. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. The whole oh, Wait a minute. Don't call Nana. There's not 99 of them, but there is an axe. Vinny's out here with an axe. The Horror King. Was he under there the whole time? What was he eating under there? And he slid an axe. That, that, that will not only make you bleed, that'll make you lose a limb. He put an axe in the wrestling match. Oh, God. Turner, come on. Get that axe out of his hands. Right now. Right now. Oh, so we might need to call the authorities. Come on. Yeah, Ian, Ian, call 911. Hey, hey, save Brady. We got to save Cody. Well, we got to save Cody. She's a ride or die for real. Wait a minute, like, you ain't going to hit my man with no this, axe. This is the one. Got your axe there, baby. <laughs> the one person Cody can still count on. The one person Cody can still rely on. Oh, let me ask you a question. She saved the day. <laughs> Would your wife do that for you? Heck yeah, she ride or die, baby. Yeah. Yeah, ride or die, baby. Look at this. Brandy, who's been who's been in this world of Bullet Club Get confusion. The axe. Oh, there she you got go. the axe. Oh, oh, no, oh. Uh -oh. no, no, no. Wow. Get out of there, Brandy. Just take the axe and go. You know what? Please. Brandy just earned my respect. She just went up three we, notches on my belt, man. We might witness a homicide right now. She says she's fighting for her, man. Work hard for money. Oh, God. Uh oh. Oh, get out of there, Vinny. Get out of there, Brandy. Don't you fall and hurt She's got that God. axe over. Oh, she oh, might God. catch him. She, she just, might catch him. She just Don't chased him into the streets of Columbus. With the axe. And here comes the smasher, Taven. He's got the, uh -oh. the historic middleweight championship belt. He's got the CMLL belt. Oh, ducks it. Cody, kick to the midsection. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, has him in position. Lights him up. Oh, runs on to the title. Did he get it? Taven. No. No he did blood. Split him open with that. Wow. How did he not split him open? That's what I was trying to see if he got him on an edge or if he's flat surfaced. Look at this. Yeah. We don't he's see Cody do this. He's, he's taking the tape off his hand. Yeah. Well, sometimes when you have your hand wrapped up and you start fighting, the pressure on your hand builds up. You have to relieve the pressure so you take off the bandage. But is this his best shot to expose the knuckles? What he's what doing is he's do freeing now. up the knuckles yeah. so it's bone oh! on the oh! He hit the belt. That's bone on steel. Yeah, what he was trying to do there was to show the knuckles, expose the knuckles, so when he hit him in the forehead, yeah. it split the skin. Yeah. It was bone on bone, yeah. and it split the skin. Oh, oh God. But Taven hand. counted God. that, oh. and he punched God. the bell. Oh, God. God. Taven's got that championship again. Swings and a miss. Oh. Double leg takedown. And look at Driving. Hold up. No, it's right. Oh, I see He's blood. I see blood. Have I seen oh, blood? I know I see blood. Oh, He's yeah. Taven open. He split Taven open. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the first blood match, Matt Taven! What is he saying? I think, I think I know what happened. What? Paul Turner, look at that. Oh, his hand is bleeding. Paul Turner, he called it. He saw the oh. blood, the blood on the, the blood on the forehead. It's Cody's knuckles. It, yeah, he busted it on the belt. And when he hit Taven in the head, Turner thought it was Taven bleeding, but it was Cody's blood. Oh my goodness. That's first blood. Look at that, Matt Taven. Wow.
When Turner pulls Cody off of David, Cody thought he won. God, look at his he, hand. He, had the, he looked at those, the, the those, forehead. Those exposed knuckles yeah. hit that belt and yeah. split Cody's knuckle open. Yeah. It split his knuckle oh, God, open. God, look at, look at him bleeding. It's like hitting a wall or hitting a tree. We've all done that before, haven't you, BJ? Uh, and what a, what a yeah. judgment call from Paul Turner. Picking up on it as Taven wiping it off of his forehead when Cody released. He saw in that split second. It's a great win for Taven. It wasn't coming from Taven, it's coming from Cody. And, and Matt Taven has defeated Cody. And you gotta think, is the conspiracy real? Not only the conspiracy might be real, but Taven's on a roll.